What's up everybody? I'm Be True, and today is not Thursday. Um, so unfortunately, with the way that things worked out, I was actually had to go fly home because my friend, one of my good friends that I grew up with, got married uh, yesterday. So today that I'm recording this is Sunday. He got married yesterday, which was Saturday. I just flew back in today. I didn't bring my laptop um, or anything that I could have recorded an events video for everybody for, which is why this video is actually a little bit late. But I figured, hey, you know what? You probably have already you know, seen all the events and everything, but if you wanted to still get my opinion on some of the events, well, I would still give it to you. So here we go. This is going to be my events video. All right. Let's take a look at the topics for this week. Oh, first and foremost, um, let's start with the features so I don't forget. There have been 20 new levels added to the Ninja exam. All right, so it used to be the top was 180. Now the top is 200, okay? Um, unfortunately for us, there are no new levels added to the equipment, um, so you don't get to upgrade the equipment anymore. Sometimes when they add new levels to the Ninja exam, They'll add a new scroll. As you can see, the, the reward for level 180 there is the scroll of Naraka. Um, so it gives you that scroll to upgrade your equipment. There's no new scroll, but this will just give you 20 more levels to get a couple more Magitama and stuff like that. Um, you might as well go ahead and finish it if you have the power to do so. So there's just a little extra, little extra added into the game right there. All right, so into our hot topics. First off, we have the Lucky Board, one of uh, the event favorites um, for sure. So... As you do, um, so let's just let's spend our uh, our stamina real quick, since we have a whole bunch just sitting around not doing anything. Okay, so there's all right. So we got our two dice. Cool. All right. So once you uh, do stuff like spend your stamina, you can get these dice. You can get two dice for free. Each dice afterwards is going to cost you 20 coupons or ingots. So once you throw the die, here we go. We got a three. Okay. So you're going to move those spaces. You're going to get whatever reward you fall on on the board. So let's get another three. Oh, it's just a two. Okay. Um, so you see it also says get five points. So if you land on a reward, an item spot, you're going to get five points. If you land on either start or any of the purple boxes, you're going to get uh, ten points. Now with those points, you come back here, we can spend them uh, on these items. So first we have Saimahata Fusion Mode Kisame, so Shark Mode Kisame. We have the Exquisite Silk Fragments. Again, like I said, if you have um, any fragments or you want to get more power, the outfits are always going to be your best options. Um, so if you don't have the Exquisite Silk yet, you're definitely going to want to get that. We again have the fourth Hokage in uh, an event where you can directly buy his fragments. No more of the RNG Lucky Wheel stuff like that. So again... Um, what I talked about with RNG and how the this game works, if you're going to spend on a ninja such as the fourth Hokage or Shisui, like when they had Shisui in um, the events uh, where it was like RNG only, okay, I highly recommend spending on events where you are guaranteed to get this character uh, for a certain amount of coupons. You know for a fact at this many coupons you are going to get this character, okay? So... On average, when you're doing the lucky board, you're going to get about 6.5 point, like, points per dice throw. So figuring that out, you can directly calculate how many coupons you need to get the fourth Hokage. So again, they're going to let you buy his fragments here. Um, not a bad option. He is an extremely strong ninja if you want him. We also have Lee Gate of Joy uh, and then some more power items. we got a Charms Material Pack and then the Advanced or the Refinement Runes Optional Pack. The reason I was going to call it an advanced ref refinement room pack is because I personally suggest you don't ever use these for anything but advanced refinement runes, okay? Uh, you hardly need any basic refinement runes, and there are plenty of ways to get medium refinement runes. Um, there are not a lot of ways to get advanced refinement runes. So when you get a chance of something like this to get advanced refinement runes, even if you don't need them yet, you should still stockpile them up as many as you can get. Um, but if you're going for power... Exquisite Silk is going to be your best option of the three items right there, okay? Next, we got a recharge rebate here. Um, starting at 3,000 ingots, we're going to be giving away, or they're going to give away uh, Ido Tensei Datara Fragments. Um, we also have the Advanced Refinement Runes pack, uh, another one there. Got a Seal Scroll, we got Ability Treasure Scroll. At 10,000, you're going to start getting Treasure Tools Rare Essence. Um, they also have a Cave Key Gift Pack, and then at 20,000, they'll give you five treasure tool rare essences and that's actually between the two of those that's eight that's a lot of power that's a good amount of power for your treasure tools right there plus you'll be getting the uh Ido Tensei data of fragments 
So if you want to maybe buy the fourth Hokage this week, um, not a bad option to take advantage of this recharge rebate. And actually, a uh, another important thing that would go along with this is the time limited shop. So by recharging all those ingots, you can then spend them to get points for this time limited shop. So with a time limited shop, uh, when you log in, you get one point. Uh, by com by using your stamina to complete instances, you might get points. Um, it's a you know like a, it's a percentage. And then if you spend ten ingots, you will get one point. So if you spend these ingots, you're guaranteed to get the points back here. You can spend them on treasure tools, common essence. So you can spend that to get more power. Uh, we have guys tortoise. We have the nine tails chakra Naruto, advanced thread. Purification rune uh, and a summoning scroll. So, direct power is going to be treasure tools, common essence, um, and then the advanced thread. You can get power from guys tortoise if you don't have it, because then you can cultivate it through summon cultivation. Um, and then same with summoning scroll, you can get points uh, and runes in order to upgrade that. So, this is going to be your most direct source of power. Then this, then him, um, then these, and then QB Naruto if you want him. Next up, we got the great plates. So basically, this is just something that you want to do uh, for free. Make sure you're doing it every day. So you claim that. You can get two keys um, per little thing it, it tells you to do here. It shows you what you have to do to get the keys. You can get up to 20 per day. With those keys, um, you just spend them back here, and you're going to get whatever we end up getting. Can we get a seal scroll? No. Okay. Um, so you can get a seal scroll, mood scroll, 10 Ambu Kakashi fragments, 5 Gate of Joy Guy fragments, 2 Shark Mokisame, Medium Refinement Runes, Purification and Protection Runes, all that good stuff. We also have rewards over here to the side. So at 150 openings, you'll get 2 Seal Scrolls and a 10% discount, discount voucher, which we will use for the daily special. 500, we get 10 5th Hokage Tsunade fragments. 1500, we get 20. And at 3500, we get the final 50. So that'll give you all of your 5th Hokage Tsunade fragments. Those keys cost 10 coupons a piece. All right. Daily packs is always here. Uh, there's a limited time recruitment going on right now. Um, this gives you time limited seal scrolls. So don't forget to spend them if you do pull during this week. Um, you're going to, because they will run out. So make sure you spend them when you get them. Our daily special then. So, like I said, you can get the discount voucher to use in here. Uh, so, you're going to get a bunch every day. It's going to open up a new shop with four items in it. Uh, and they're going to come to you at a discount. So, you can see right here, normally seal scrolls are 125 coupons a piece. Right now, if you buy them here, it's only 110. So, these are already at a discount. You can then stack a more, uh, even higher discount on them if you had a voucher. So, let's say you got that 10% discount voucher. You could then take an additional 10% off of these seal scrolls right there um, if that's what you wanted to get. We got Koshina down there, uh, five seal scrolls, one seal scroll. And then each day as they open, um, you'll get four new items. One thing to keep in mind, that discount voucher is only valid for the day that you are on. Okay, So you could not use that discount voucher on any of the day three items because we are currently on day four. Okay, So if you're going to use a discount voucher, it has to be on the day of the shop that opens. Call for Duty is still here. Um, the weekend missions isn't part of that. And then finally, we have Sakura's Festival. So we have a discount voucher in Sakura's Festival. So there's actually a percent chance that you can get um, a 10% discount voucher just from doing Sakura's Festival. Uh, you can get five spins on this every day just from doing your daily missions. So just don't forget to do those. Uh, we got you know coupons. Uh, normally, this is the, uh, the slot for Ninja Fragments, but this time they actually gave us a discount voucher. Um, so just don't forget to do this. You can get some power back here. It's for free, so you know got to love free, right? All right. <laughs> anyway. Sorry that it is late. Like I said, I didn't have any way of recording this video since I flew home um, and I didn't bring anything with me because I was only going to be home for three days. Uh, so I went home, saw my friend get married. It was an awesome cell, you know, ceremony and everything. So he is now officially the first one of our friends to be a married man, which is kind of kind of crazy to think about, you know. But uh, hey, I guess we're starting to get to around that age. I don't, I'm not ready for marriage. Not even close. But to each their own, right? All right, well, thank you all for watching. Sorry that it is late. Hopefully, you can still get a little bit of benefit out of this video. Hope you guys all have a great day. I will see you all in the next video, and peace.